couldn't get in the lane, and she's physical defensively. Good news for Noelle Quinn as the Providence Swedish road to recovery is clean. No injuries here in Seattle until the storm score. Goombawale going high low, which is exactly what they did on Saturday, but a little too high. And Jewel comes the other way, steps into a three and knocks it down. No, a long two for the Dallas Wings. Good sidestep move there by Sims. Misses that one, offensive rebound, McCowan. Agumba Wale, three on the way, and she and Jewel already going back and forth, and we've only played a minute. Here's Diggin Smith backing in on Agumba Wale, finds Ezzy Magdor inside, turns, and can't get it to go. I didn't want her to pivot the other way, and she went baseline side. I don't think she realized she was initially open, took a dribble, and the defense recovered. And inside quickly. Gets it knocked out by Skylar Diggins Smith, but they get it back. Plenty of time to work. Oh, look at Jordan Horson getting in that passing lane. She's got Skylar up top instead. She's going to take it right to the window and put it up in hand. Jordan Horston. 10 on the shot clock. Agumba Wall across the timeline after a spoke free. Howard with it. 15 footer and good. You've got a couple on this Dallas team. I mean, when Tierra McCowan goes out, you still got Brown that come in, comes in. And a dribble drive and a nice score with the left hand on the right side by Odyssey Sims. And it's 11-6 wings. And it was a rough matchup on Uzun as well, defensively on Saturday. And that may be why she's not starting tonight. Oh, a nice high-low inside again. And, and what an asset she has been. Here's Ezzie Magdeborg from the weak side, stripping it away from Natasha Howard. She's going to lead the break. Looking inside, there's Horston on the weak side. Big to big. And feed inside, and McCowan wasn't ready for it. She was wide open. Oh, look at that pass to Skylar Dickens-Smith. They had 23 points off turnovers on Saturday. 6-0 push by Seattle. Ooh, answered there by Natasha Howard as bodies go to the floor. Ooh, answered there by Natasha Howard as bodies go to the floor. Jewel's gonna pull up. She hit the last one and this one. You know what happens when Jewel is in the flow. <laughs> oh. McKay, my goodness. So well that sometimes the seas just part and you just get ridiculously easy looks. Biggest lead of the game for Seattle's at three here. And Natasha Howard going the other way and scores. So two fouls on Ezzie Magbagor, two on Mercedes Russell. So both of the bigs for Seattle in a bit of foul trouble here early, and that could be with Bill Lambeer on one side and his assistant coach Rick Mahorn on the other yeah, saying, what, Ooh. <laughs> You have to have a tough basketball team. You have Bill Lambeer and Rick Mahorn on the bench. Directing traffic is Skyler. Screen and roll home. She'll take it right in and lay it up with the left hand. Joiner Holmes, nicely done there. Set up by Skyler Diggins Smith. And Skyler Diggins Smith, who spent some time on the Goomba Wallet. Now it's Jordan Horston who has the check. And Skyler Diggins Smith right to the window. A crossover dribble and a finish. It's not my mistake. That is what Seattle does. Yep. They've got phenomenal athletes that can pressure the basketball. Oh, good back cut. Great find by. Agumba Wale inside to Howard for the layup. Natasha Howard in her old home. Ten points, five rebounds already for the former Storm champion. Oh, back cutting is Jewel Lloyd. And Neka Gumake finds her and feeds her with an easy pass for the layup. The defense forcing a really difficult low percentage shot. Lopez Seneschal guarding Lloyd. No good there. Offensive rebound as nobody sealed the weak side. And they've got just so much youth on this Dallas team. The veteran presence of Sims has been a welcome addition. Lloyd spinning. Good hook pass inside Ezzie Magbador. And those two have just Seattle off to the races again. Good defense again by the Rook. But Lloyd's going to take it right to the window and score. How do you defend that? And she's put up 30 in back-to-back -back games. And Drew Lloyd's already has, already has 12. My goodness, here's Odyssey. Sims the other way, puts it up and in. Back at Gumake. Back to Diggins Smith. Three on the shot clock. Gets right by the D. And how about that going right up to the right side after bringing it over with the left hand? A straight line drive by Skyler Diggins Smith, just putting pressure on. And a Goomba Wally answers. Dallas has done a nice job. Seattle. 
She has one. Here's Mecca working hard on Billings, gaining some space. Just a little bit of a chicken wing there to give her extra. As Seattle was the more aggressive team drawing the foul. Well, I think for Barike, the one thing that she realizes is that she's gotten in the lane and gone right at the heart of the Seattle defense. Yeah. Down one to Gubawale. Put her head down again. Back ball gets poked away. This time, the foul is not called on Dallas. Here's a Gubawale the other way, and she flips it up with the right hand. 12 seconds left, and down to a six-point game. For the beginning of the third quarter. Here's a bullet pass to Horston. Good extra check inside the neck of Gubake. Boy, Seattle couldn't have known that the zone was coming. Odyssey Sims with the left hand is up and in. Nice shot there by Odyssey Sims. And she just looks so much more confident and sure of herself. Well, she's driving at, you know, 60 miles an hour instead of 95 miles an hour like she was driving last year. 12 overall when they drafted the teenager. So the free throws and the ball. Jewel tries to make it a four-point possession. And back to Ezzy. She'll try her hand at it. That one's no good. There's Jordan Horston. She's everywhere. Tees up, Jewel. Hello. 55-39. Seattle threatening to walk away from Dallas again. She just flies around, coming out of nowhere, gets offensive rebounds. Here's Jewel coming the other way. Two on one break. Seattle trying to extend their biggest lead of the game, and they will. 57-39. Dallas in deep, deep trouble right now. Horston has it. Back out Lloyd. And Skyler had a bucket. Lloyd, step back three. That one snuggles home. Jewel Lloyd. And remember, Jewel's gone for 30 in five of the last six games against Dallas, and she is on pace to make it six out of seven. Nice step through move there. Three straight games here at home. Seattle's outscored Dallas by an even 40 points in the last 48 hours. Make it 43. Everybody up 24. Well, Seattle right now is just having a ton of fun. And a nice drive there. Tough move by Monique Billings all the way to the window, and she scores and will go to the free throw line. And being able to get there, the most two-plus game streaks. Well, Jewel's been there before. Sammy flips it up with some nice... Back spin and almost gets the steal. League leader in points scored over 24 points per game. Oh, steal by Ezzy. She's going to take it. One on zero. Coasting in for the easy bucket. What screens are you going to go over because they shoot the three? What screens are you going to go under because they're a driver? And Howard just talked about her being stuck on 10. That's her first points of the second half. She now has 13 in the game. One second differential game and shot here in the end of the third. Mercedes Russell back into the game to Vivians. Good ball movement. Diggins Smith. Long three on the way. Nothing but twine. Mercedes Russell with it. Back to Holmes. Gets a step on Howard. Inside the Mercedes and one. And the contact of Mercedes flexing on him. I don't think I've ever seen that before from Mercedes Russell. And you could hear a little cheer for Stephanie Suarez, who mom was from here in the state of Washington, as we mentioned the other day. Is Mule going to get a shot to shoot? Well, Sammy gets one here and knocks it down. Sammy Whitcomb to the two-minute mark we go. In a game that's been all storm since the end of the first quarter. Dallas actually led at the end of the first quarter. That would have been a cherry on the top, but I tell you what, this Sunday tasted pretty good tonight. 95-71.